Okay, so Dragon Ball Super Broly did accomplish one first. Now let me explain this. Typically in Dragon Ball movies, there is a phenomenon where a character who is capable of a transformed state does usually get to flex. You can look at this through the original Dragon Ball uh, Broly, where he achieved the legendary Super Saiyan state, and he did a lot of flexing. He fought off five or six super-powered warriors who are way beyond the Super Saiyan transformation. And, you know, if you don't want to just look at Broly, you can look at Revenge of Cooler. Of course, he dominated base form Goku. Kaioken Goku and then you know met an even match with Super Saiyan Goku before having his own supernova uh, turned against him then you look at the Android movie Android 13 you know they did a lot of cool stuff in their base forms but when they became Super 13 they really got the flex and it gave us that that iconic uh, nut shot between Super 13 and Goku you can also look at oh the Janemba movie you know, he did tons of cool stuff in his big form, but he went into the iconic red form and he dominated Super Saiyan 3. It did a lot of flexing. Uh, Bojack movie. You can look at all movies where a character is tra capable of transforming and they dominate in the transformed state to show that it is a serious threat. Dragon Ball Super Broly is the first movie ever to break this tradition, to break this phenomenon where a character goes into their ultimate form and they get dominated and they get destroyed and they don't even do a, a single attack. This is like the only accolade, the only accomplishment that the Dragon Ball Super Broly has done and it's an embarrassment. And I mean this, people who've watched this movie free online, you know what I'm talking about basically did nothing in Super Saiyan and then went into his like Super Saiyan full power state to honestly just do nothing at all and I and I went back and I thought about this and I said whoa this is literally the first time that has ever happened every single movie even the Garlic Jr. movie you go back little Garlic Jr. okay he did whatever Turns into Big Garlic Jr., he beats the ever-loving heck out of Piccolo and Goku. So, I, I just thought it was interesting, and I thought it was interesting enough to bring to your attention. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I, get, I hope I gave you guys some food for thought about how Broly has negatively broken certain traditions in the Dragon Ball lore. Of course, I'm your perfect being and the number one anime gaming and Dragon Ball channel on YouTube. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, click that notification bell, join the Discord server, and also think about supporting the channel through pay, uh, Patreon or the Streamlabs link down below. Of course, I'll see you in the next video and peace.